I keep this, I keep my vehicle pretty well stocked up anyway. My backpack's a little heavy, but that's usual. I'm not going to carry all this stuff into the cabin. <clears throat> not going to carry all this stuff into the cabin. I just kind of go for 24 hours and, and stock up. Yep, here we are, living off the land, getting by in the wilderness best we can. Okay, we made it. Got a campfire started. And this is what the cabin looks like. And I'll show you what it looks like inside. Wood stove. Got some firewood stacked for the night. And our bunks. View out our kitchen, kitchen table. Right by a little stream, so we got a little fresh water. Plenty of birch around for firewood. I already got the wood stove and everything all stacked up for the night. They give you a bow saw and they have quite a bit of cut wood way over there, but you still gotta kinda hunker in. It's, it's This is a little better shot out here. It kinda shows what the granite on the beach looks like. Sun's going down fast, it's gonna get cold, but I don't know, but I think the I think the actual mine is was up there, one of the big shafts. I climbed up there once, and there's some pretty scary looking caving in spots and stuff up there. It's kind of a tough climb up there, but. I think more of the mine was actually over there. Hit a big rock crossing that stream back there, but that's just water dripping under it now. But boy, I hit a rock in that stream. Don't try that stream crossing back there with a crossover, I'll tell you. Let me tell me what these things were, and then we'll both know. They're all lined with stones inside. You can actually crawl inside them. But this was all a mine, a building, in here by the looks of it. Pretty big complex by the looks of it. 
But this was all a mine complex of some sort by the looks of it. I don't know if it was all outdoors or what. You can see there are big, big uh, vats of some sort down there. Boy, look at the big cables. This is some kind of a smelter. I think you can almost go in it right over here. Ooh, scary hole. Ooh. Anywhere around these things where you got holes, they're probably scary stuff. Ooh, not walking in there. Wow, look at that. Big operation, whatever the heck it is. Ooh, scary. Scary passageways. This little Coleman single burner stove works good. I use it a lot. It burns uh, unleaded or Coleman fuel, and and uh, doing a lot of this stuff, you kind of find out what works and what doesn't. Can't beat a wood stove. Although this one takes, in this cabin, takes some um, getting used to keeping it going just right without getting the cabin too warm or too cold.